All right, going back on the uh, sculpture of Noah. I'm going to take it to the uh, foundry this week, along with a couple other clays to get bids on. And just so I know pr pretty much where I can uh, price something like this at. All right, be right back. Time to play with some clay. I'm going to be working on his hands <clears throat> today and uh, try to get it worked out uh, in the beard and on top of the uh, the arc. Now, the problem with the arc is it's going to have to be cast separate. And they're going to have to be able to remove the arc from his lap to cast it separate. So that means whatever I do with fingers is going to have to be able to be removed with the arc. And I don't know how I'm going to do that. That's what i got to figure out. But for now, I'm just going to work on this hand here and get that as far as I can. And uh, I increased the length of his uh, uh, drapery here skirt, whatever you want to call it. And uh, that was because uh, I just wanted to have a little longer. It was just a little too short for my eye. And I'm filling in underneath it. Because they still got to be able to cast under it. And they can't have the deep undercut there. And uh, so it's a matter of filling in under but making it look like it isn't filled in.
I'm just imagining that when he is at this point where he's built this model to scale the magnitude of what he's been asked to do might be settling in and uh because he's never done anything like this before it could be that he is taking a deep breath Bronson all lighter fluid, it uh, melts the clay just a little bit and smooths it out where it's rough. It kind of blends it in where you want it to blend in too. It's just a finishing touch. next uh, area which is the other hand
put a carving knife in his hand. Now this is the other end of the handle of the knife. And it's got to line up with the uh, knife itself. And I curve the uh, end. Alright, let's see if uh, I can get the ship back in there without uh, destroying the hand. And it's got to be done this way when they uh, get ready to cast it. And it works just fine. That's going to work just fine. I got a son to do. I'll do that next time, which will be tomorrow. Sometime this week, I've got to go to both uh, to Livingston to the uh, foundry. I don't know what day it's going to be. It's not going to be right away, though. All right. I'm happy with that. Now, the only thing I worry about is somebody rubbing their finger along here and then stabbing their finger with the, uh, the knife. <laughs> As they're touching the uh, bronze, I hope they'll be wise enough to know that there's something pointy right there. So I always worry about those things, having things pointy, uh, things that can harm somebody when they touch the bronze. Because people do. They touch them and they like to feel them. I'm really happy with the way that hand turned out and the way the beard turned out. All right, everybody, I'll see you next time. And I'll be working on his feet and legs. All right, good night, everybody. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.